comes in faster than them. Sure. Oh, he sash, damn. That's crazy, bro. <laughs> That's insane. Yo, what's up guys, AFC Dino here and welcome to a new video. Uh, today, we're going to do the first ever Pokemon Showdown live. On Pokemon Showdown, of course. Um, I'm doing it on a fresh account. Um, and Because all my alt accounts were above 1700 and I wanted an account in the 1500s so I can record with it and such. Um, so I was leveling, I was ranking up a new account. But I believe this account is somewhere in the third... 1350 or something. Uh, let me check real quick. 1344. But yeah, uh, we're still undefeated on this account. I was testing this team as well. I, I just I built it yesterday, and yeah, it's um. But now it seems pretty decent uh, with the Covert Glow Gold Dango against uh, Organicals. If I run into it, I've been op opening up more to Choice Bandit. Um, uh, Chen Pao again. Can go over the team. Um, oh, this is a different team. Oh, uh, I chose to go with Full Corona. Uh, because I've been seeing a... Uh, on Wi-Fi, I've been having a lot of issues with uh, Iron Valiant. Full Corona counts really well, in my opinion. Uh, resisting both tab. Looks effect's always decent. Um, and switch pivoting into Chiyu and scouting what Chiyu is going to do to us. I have the Gold Dengo. Uh, with Covid Cloak, of course, uh, versus Garganical, which is uh, kind of annoying in the meta. Uh, obviously, Great Dusk, always solid. Always solid. It's going to be our Stealth Rocker and Rapid Spinner. Then I have Chen Pao uh, with the Choice Band. I chose to go with Jolly Nature uh, with with the addition of Cinderace. Um, I wanted to be faster than Cinderace. And then we have Corvid Knight. Uh, I chose to go with Bulk Up and not, not with Defog. Because uh, if we use bulk up, we can bulk up uh, alongside something like a uh, Dragon Knight, uh, for example, or in Gambit, for example. Uh, but yeah, those are the examples. I went with Giga Drain, but I'm considering Will O Wisp as well. But on the other hand, Giga Drain offensively just provides me more. So for now, I went with Giga Drain, but uh, on a different team, I have uh, Will O Wisp. But. Uh, yeah, that's gonna be the team guys so uh, hopefully you'll enjoy the first ever Pokemon Showdown live. It's a bit in the lower rankings but uh, yeah, I wanted to rank up this account and might as well record it right so we're gonna look for a battle and yeah um, if you guys haven't already consider subscribing and it seems that we're playing against Stall. If I had you I would completely obliterate this guy. <laughs> Only okay. One good thing though is um, if Florges is a special defensive Pokemon, yeah, I did you see? Uh, Florges is a special defensive Mon, and Chimpao with Crunch can do a lot of damage to him. Joyce Bennett Crunch. Um, but I might want to Terrestrialize Gold Bengo this game uh, because if I Terrestrialize him into a flying type, um, he won't be able to. I honestly think Gold Bengo is just going to smash this guy. But. Uh, just have to see. I'm gonna lead up with the Great Dusk and I'm gonna start knocking things off. And we're gonna hit the timer, of course, to assert our dominance. And yeah, I'm gonna knock him off first. I don't know what he's going to do. If he's going to Iron Defense, doesn't really matter. I do have a went into Among Us. I get off my knockoff, which is cool. He was leftovers. Interesting. I'm gonna go into Goldengo here. He shouldn't be able to touch me. Let's see. He is 1407. <laughs> As he goes for Spore, doesn't work of course, and I'm just gonna go for... I'm gonna go for Nasty, but he goes Cloud Sire. And I'm gonna Terrestrialize into a Flying type here, I'm just gonna shut up and find out if this is unaware. It doesn't seem to be unaware. I'm doing quite a lot of damage, I'm gonna make it rain there. Yeah. I guess that was Water Absorb, but like I said, guys, he, he, he brought Stall, but uh, Goldango completely smashes him. Uh, goes into Skeledurge. I'm gonna shut up all here as he terrestrializes into a Fire type. Still doing quite some damage there. He goes for Tarch, so, but the next one is gonna kill him. 
So I'm just gonna Shadow Ball again uh, due to the Spadap drop, of course. And now he cannot Terrestrialize. He cannot Terrestrialize. So, like I said, this Pokemon is gonna completely smash this guy. That Torchland did a lot, though. My opponent decides to pour it, putting, putting him back into the 1300s. Let's go for the next one. Quick little game, quick little game. Um, let's see. I'm not sure for how long I'm going to record here. Okay, yes. Bellopar with Bloat Soul. So that's going to be annoying dealing with the Bloat Soul. I do have Terra Water on my Corviknight. So I will probably Terrestrialize Corviknight this game. Not to be able to deal with uh, with this situation. I'm going to lead up with Champao in this one. I don't think I necessarily need Chimpao here. It's, it's gonna be Ice Shard anyway, so I'm just gonna crunch here. And I can remove... Because if he goes for Hazards, if he go if he kills me, that's fine too. But if he goes for Hazards, he doesn't have anything that comes in on Crunch. I can just crunch here. And I can remove the Toxic Spikes with my... Um, with my Tox Specs. And then I just need to look for an opportunity to... Um, DD, okay. The Psychic Surge. Do I want to terrestrialize this? It's gonna bank for Bunker. And that's fine. I don't like I'm losing anything here. I'm gonna click Toxic here. Uh, toxic again. There we go. I don't, I don't believe Bomad has any... <laughs> okay. Uh, 1400s incoming soon. Um, I think I'm 14 and 14 and 0 now. <laughs> That's kind of funny. The quick forfeits, guys. The quick forfeits. So we found our next game. And I close this one. Okay. Um, so he has a Dragapult, which, is actually, which can actually be annoying if he's... Bandit, but it can be Wisp as well. Um, I do have Ice Shard. I am Fretz is there. We'll then go for Loom in case I need it. I would like to keep the thing on Great Dusk again. Should I lead up? I'm gonna lead up with Volcarona actually. She leads Dragapult, which is fine. Um, I'm just gonna go into Corvair. Because if he's Joy's banned, but I'm quite defensive, so I'm just gonna go for some chip. I'm I'm actually a bulky Volk, and I want to find out what kind of uh, drug of both this is. It could be Willow Wisps as well. So uh... but if I get some chip on him, I can knock him out with Ice Shard uh, later on. Actually, I should probably. Um... Put this into the builder. So clear the imported sets. Just have to call Grady basically. Oh, did I just? Oh, it's only Volk. Um... Oh, he 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 just went for Draco. He missed. Not sure if that's specs. I'm gonna quiver dance then if he. <laughs> that is unfortunate. I would never die to Draco, so um my fairy dance here. I don't need more speed necessarily. And we're gonna just morning sun on this one. He decides to forfeit. I mean that's how you get 1400 boys. But I'm gonna put this into hold up. I'm gonna do this again. Reset this. Put the team in there. Cool. Right. That Draco miss is unfortunate, but I don't think I ever die. And like I said, I wanted the damage up. Um, he did forty six by the way. What should he do to? Oh, he did. He didn't. He he did forty six at plus one. So basically sixty. Guess that would be into it, KO. Um, but uh. Yeah, we got to the next one. Fortunate Draco miss. But the chip was enough for me to knock him out with Ice Shard. Now I get... Okay, luckily he doesn't have Palmad on his team. But that's... That's a good thing. 
um, in the terms of lead. Might lead off with Zai Chen Pao again. He does have High Dragon as a switch. I have to say, um, I think Ice Spinner is probably better in this game. Uh, using Ice Spinner if he leads off with Glomora. Like he has to be like um I spin I am because he does go for rocks because I spinner he switches in work it's something he doesn't switch in well to because iron threat is also a ground type and Pelipper I the reason I, I I'm not going for crunch is because um he has high, high dragon which can come in on crunch and I don't know if he's scarfed by the way, if he goes Pelipper, I'm actually going to stay in. Okay. Okay. I want to Ice Spinner so badly. I might want to keep Ice Shark for the High Dragon. Depending on what we're dealing with. I really hope he doesn't go for Volt Switch. <laughs> they went for Knock Up, that's fine. In a U-turn there. Go Spelliper. And I'm gonna go into my Toxapex. This one. And we're gonna go for Toxic here. Come on. Come on. Come on. Go oh, okay. Let's go. A baneful bunker anticipating the U-turn. Unfortunately, I don't get it off, which sucks. Would have been able to stall it out a bit, but uh, I might need to terrestrialize my Corviknight later on. So I'm actually gonna go into. Well, it would be an unboosted Rage Fist, right? I'm just gonna go go um, then go here. I don't want to terrestrialize this, so if he terrestrializes into a water type, is that gonna do something for me? I can I can obviously terrestrialize this, but I, I might need it on Corviknight um, to deal with the uh, Lotom. Um, I do have Toxapex though. I do have Toxapex. Like, if I terrestrialize into a flying type, I will most likely claim a kill here. Be an unboost, unboosted rage fist for him. Do I nasty blood again or do I shadow ball? A nasty blood again. Yeah, it's an unboosted rage fist. And as long as I don't touch him there, um, I can recover here. I'm a flying type, so in that sense, I'm I'm not in danger of dying to this. He's a salt fest, damn. And he'll be forced to go into uh, Pelipper or into Hydreigon. Wait, and I, I'm not sure if he can knock me out there. Since he terrestrialized into a water type, like he needs to click Draco or something, right? He lost his Steel type, so he has no toxic community. Let's try to attempt to toxic him here, because I do get it off. Perfect. And I'm gonna go for the Baneful Bunker. Kinda wanna bring in Great Paws. Yeah, regular Dark Pills, right? Yeah. So I'll be able to Rapid Spin there. Unless he changes moves, but I didn't see leftovers on him. Annihilate is a, is a water type now. He can go, don't get me wrong, he can go Annihilate, but he has no means of bringing it back. And Pelipper is the one that comes in.
And I'm just gonna go back there. The U turns. But I have Baneful Bunker, so I can use that next turn. Tries to drop a Draco on me. Wonder if I don't even know if that's going to kill me to be honest. Um since he's most likely locked, I'm, I can just go Corv. Just roost on the next turn. Oh my god, he crit me. And I'll keep him as a sack later on. Um, we're gonna go back into packs. And I'm gonna I'm gonna use Surf here. I'm gonna click Toxic. Um, if he goes Spell Upper and then he's just wasting rain turns. Goes Annihilate or Float Soul. I can catch something. That's Specs. <laughs> Looks to be Specs. That was a resisted attack, so I'm su kind of surprised. He didn't terrestrialize Float Soul yet, though. Gotta keep that in mind, but the moment the rain is gone, um, I think my uh, Chen Pao kind of wins. Yeah, exactly. Amazing Toxic on our part there. And we still didn't touch the guy, so I can just go Golden Go. As my opponent decides to forfeit, putting him back into the 1400s. Uh, we're, we're 16 minutes in, so uh, we can keep recording. <laughs> Ooh, what is this? What is this? Cerulege, Espion. Okay, okay. So, uh, I won't be getting up rocks, I guess. Let me uh, bring in Corv. I don't have Sucker Punch on Chen Pao, so Cerulege might actually be uh, scarier. And U turn there. U turns, but he's gonna take Rocky Helmet Chip there. Almost take no damage at all there. If he goes into Sableye, um, I can just go into my um, my Chen Pao. I burn me. He cannot burn me with Prankster. This is Rocky Helmet too. Damn boy. Damn. But do I terrestrialize this? I will basically get a kill if I terrestrialize this, but I might want to keep, uh, make. I want to keep the fire, uh, the water terrestrialization. Crunch that regular year. Fine. Still gonna die. I didn't want to terrestrialize uh, just because I want to keep the water for Sir Rulich. I think Sir Rulich is probably the biggest threat on us on his team. If he source dances up, that is. I'm gonna go into Corvair. If anything, I can terrestrialize this into a water type too. Yeah. Um, kind of strange, but <laughs> a U turn there, just for raw bitter blade. This weak armor, though it's unboosted, so I can just go into Great Dusk, and we're just gonna knock him off. He dropped his defense anyway uh, with the weak armor. Goes into Meow Scarada. Is that Corvair? Goes for Flower Trick, which I four times resist. Let's see if I can get off a Roost. He must have anything. Did I knock off a uh, Choice Band? A Choice Scarf. Okay. So Rulich comes in again. Back into Great Dusk. Just the Bitter Blade. And... No, earthquake Air. It's a good Stealth Rock as well, but he has Espion. So I don't want to Stealth Rock into Espion, because... Um, I'd rather... Uh, I'd rather have, for have this... Oh my god. <laughs> Come on, bro. <laughs> Fucking hell. But I have Chin Pao in the back. Do I need this? I don't honestly need this. I'm just gonna Brave Bird. I guess uh, something like Nasty Pal is coming my way. But yeah, he used Shadow Ball, so I can go into Chin Pao. If he's. Worst case, he's. He's Sash or something. 
Is this the fastest Pokemon on this? Well, oh, okay. Interesting Ender. First body. It's a Lagberry. Interesting. I do have Ice Shard in the back, so I can just go into this. I wonder if he has uh, Destiny Bond on this. Got a Baneful Bunker here. Just a scout for Destiny Bond. I don't see it. I'm just gonna surf then. Ender! Ender! <laughs> he gets the Curse Body again. It's unfortunate. Do I have to wrestleize this? Future side, what? Okay. Interesting. Gonna go Golden Go here. And we're just gonna click Shadow Ball. Okay. <laughs> Interesting stuff. Rulish comes in, I assume he's gonna shadow sneak me. He still hasn't terrestrialized, so gotta be a bit mindful. Um can be Terra Bug. I wonder if he's gonna Does he even live? Hold up. Uh Chen Pao. Village. Hmm. Oh. He's still okay, he's still gonna die too much Chenpao. Unless he has uh terror fighting or something. Gonna crunch here. <clears throat> <laughs> okay, I see. I see. Oh, that doesn't matter too much. Because he still dropped his defense. Just Earthquake here. Terror of fighting. Yeah. And if Gardevoir isn't. Um, if he's using Future Side, I, I, I wonder if he has. Uh, Anything that kills me. Oh, yeah, he had Moonblast, of course. Now I can just go into uh, Volcarona. Traces the Curse Body. Yeah. Uh, we win this one. Closing in on the 1500s. Uh, let's see. Where are we? 23 minutes in. Uh, we can get in another game. Ooh, this is kind of scary because my team is. I think my team will become really good once GU is banned. But uh, yeah, GU is always going to be an issue. So I lead. I'm going to lead off with my Chen Pao. That way I don't get screwed over if... Um... Well, actually, it might be um... Annihilate with Stealth Rock. Might be annihilate stealth rock. Race comes in faster than them. Chair. Oh, he sash, damn. That's crazy, bro. <laughs> That's insane. That's actually insane. Interesting. I they are usually heavy duty boots, but uh, I guess he led off with it. 
wasn't respecting the fact, I guess. Uh, so I'm really reliant on Volcarona winning this game, unfortunately. Leads up with Bahamut. Gonna use... Is he gonna use Revival Blessing? I hope so. Oh, never mind. He just killed me. He Choice Bandit? Life Orb. God, I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna lose. That's crazy, bro. I'm, not, I'm gonna lose to Roaring Moon. Wait. Oh, he... <laughs> okay. You cool, you cool. Does this mean he can use it again? Because... It doesn't say that he lost his electric typing with the terrestrialization. That's crazy, bro. Still didn't terrestrialize yet, so... I actually, I honestly didn't know that worked uh, like that, but uh, it is what it is. I'm probably gonna lose now. <laughs> I, I got cheesed too, way too hard there. And he can still use Revival Blessing to bring something back. But I'm, I'm gonna lose to Chi Yu at this point. And go down. I'm gonna still try though. But I'm I'm gonna lose to Chiyu anyway. I might as well forfeit actually. I might as well forfeit, but maybe he clicks over he then got and misses or something. I don't know. Yeah, there's no way. <laughs> yeah, it's over. <laughs> So I got cheesed uh, immediately uh, with, by the Poker Sash, turn 1. Um, not something you'll typically face. Not something you'll typically face. Usually it's heavy duty boots, but yeah, we're, we're still low on the ladder. So that, that kind of crazy stuff happens. It does have a ghost type in this. Let's see. I leave with this guy. Ascarain comes in, and I'm gonna run a nasty plot there. Picky web, air slash usually. A ball. Yeah, air slash. Typically sash as well. I'm gonna recover on this turn. Stay as healthy as possible, of course. Yeah, we're just gonna make shut up all again. The U ends up coming in. Um, Dark Bills definitely coming my way. But I have Tux specs. Let's see if he specs. Goes for Flame. It's fine. I'm gonna use Surf here. The Goldengo coming in. I don't see anything on him. Uh, I'm just gonna surf again. It's for Shadow Ball. Looks to be specs, I'd, I'd like to say. Looks to be specs. Actually, need to keep more HP on this uh, so I can. Uh, in a baneful bunker. We got some damage off on him, but I'm gonna go Volcare. It's not affected by the sticky webs, of course. Yeah, that's definitely specs. I should be able to um, fire off a fairy dance. I'm gonna morning sun though. I 
We got Corvair. Goes for Knock, which is fine, I guess. And I'm gonna click U turn. Dango comes in. And now I get Volcarona in. We use Fairy Dance, I guess. I'll come out and next time I can Rapid Spin uh, pretty freely. I'm not gonna terrestrialize this though. This is where we, where we kept the extra HP for on Pex. He goes for a blast. Crazy. Crazy. I'm gonna surf again. If I had Willow Wisp on this, that would be cool. He didn't terrestrialize yet, though. I haven't revealed Body Press. I'm just thinking. <clears throat> I'm gonna terrestrialize into a flying type. I can use Baneful Bunker with Doxapex to poison him. Yeah, it is flying, so we knock him here. So goes for Iron Head. Not doing not doing much actually. But I'm gonna rapid spin. I have Ice Shard in the back. I do have Ice Shard in the back. He did knock my Corvin Knight though. Fair. I need some chips so I can knock him out with Ice Shard. Which is now. Um... Great Dusk ends up coming in. I'm gonna go into my own Great Dusk here. Goes for a knockoff. I should not be inside of kill range. Don't see. Z. Earthquake here. Just making sure I've got some damage off on him. I try to set up my stealth rock. Oh, nice play. Nice play. Should have rapid. Should have spun again, but that's definitely a bulky uh, great tusk. I don't think he's faster than. Uh, let's see, twenty-five percent right. Twenty-five percent. Oh, it might be jolly. Okay, might be an offensive one. Um, then I'm gonna use this. I think I still didn't terrestrialize yet, so I can terrestrialize here. And we can go, go for the... Well, since he's faster than me, I might as well qu Quiver Dance. Basically get the boost, then Giga. He goes Chi Yu. But that's fine, uh, I can just go Pex. He has to go for the fire type attack anyway. And now I can go for Toxic. As he goes Great Tusk. And if I keep Goldengo at that amount of HP, um, Iron Bellion shouldn't be able to knock me out. Um, I can freely Baneful Bunker first though. So Chen Pao might be booster energy on him though. Uh, but I definitely need to keep this guy. 
then it's just a matter of did terrestrialize is I lost all my resistances. I'm just gonna go into Google Corona. And we're I'm just gonna kick out here. EU com comes in. Um stay in. Goes for psychic. I get the fairy dance damage off. Isn't much. Staying in. I think he's choiced. I can just go this. And we're clicking Ice Spinner. Because uh, so we're choice banded, so we definitely knocked out the Chiyu there. And he's gone. Cool. And I'm clicking Ice Spinner here again. And that's how we win. So let's see. 35 minutes in. 35 minutes in. Put ourselves at 1439. Uh, I get like 100 points. Closing in on its 1500, but I'm gonna end up the recording here, guys. Uh, so, unfortunately, we lost one game to that stupid cheese shit. But, uh, other than that, though, wow, I think it was a cool life. It was the first one ever. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to hit that like button, guys. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions. I'll leave a poker paste of this team in the description if you guys are interested. Um, I think it's quite a good team uh, once she was banned. And yeah, I hope to see you in the next video. Have a wonderful day. Peace out.